Hi, boys and girls. Welcome back. Our story today is Jack and Lisa have a race. Have you ever raced before? Maybe you raced against your friends out on the out on the track, or maybe you raced against your buddies down the sidewalk near home. Well, our story is called Jack and Lisa have a race. Jack was two years older than his sister Lisa. Jack could do most things better than Lisa, and Jack could read better and write better. Jack could lift heavier things than Lisa could lift, and Jack could run faster than Lisa. But Lisa did something that Jack didn't do. Every morning, Lisa got up and ran three miles. While Lisa was running, Jack was sleeping. One day, Jack and Lisa were on their way to school. Jack said, you're always running to the, in the morning, but I can still run faster than you. I'll show you. Come on, let's race to the corner. Before Lisa could say anything, Jack said, get ready, go, and started to run. Lisa ran too, but she could not keep up with her brother. When Lisa reached the corner, Jack was waving and smiling, but he was out of breath. He said, I told you, <sighs> or pant, pant, I could beat you, pant, pant. Lisa said, you are fast in a short race, but I'll, be, I'll bet I can run a mile faster than you can. Jack said, that's a joke. Pant, pant, I can run a lot faster than you, pant, but so I could beat you in a mile, pant. Lisa said, you're already out of breath, and we only ran a thousand feet. Remember, a mile is over five thousand feet, so your tongue will be hanging out long before you've run a mile. Jack said, that's not a pant, so, so I'm faster than you. No matter how far we run, the children argued some more. Then they agreed to race a mile on Saturday. On Saturday, Jack and Lisa went to a bike path near the river. They started up at a place that was one mile from the big white bridge. Jack said, by the time you get to the bridge, you'll see me there resting in the grass. The race started and Jack was soon far ahead of Lisa. He looked back and smiled. Come on, he called. Is that as fast as you can run? Lisa did not answer. By the time Jack could reach, could clearly see the white bridge, he was running much slower. Lisa was now right behind him, running quite a bit faster than he was. Who do you think's going to win? Hmm, let's see if we can find out. By the time Jack was close enough, to read the large signs over the bridge, Lisa was 200 feet ahead of him. She was pulling away and he was panting like a sick dog. Lisa won the race by a thousand feet. After Jack caught his breath and was able to speak without panting, he said to Lisa, You are right. I can't run a mile as fast as you, so I'll have to start running with you in the mornings. And that is what he did. The End